James, you want to come home with me for supper tonight? Well, it might <laughs> be a good idea for you to meet my son. Son? Yeah, my son Brian. He lives here in town with his family. He has his own family. Yeah. He's very busy. I don't see much of him, but he's coming to supper tonight. And I thought it might be nice for you to join us, okay? All right. Okay. I'll give you a lift back to Mrs. Flowers and put on your new suit. Okay. Okay. All right. He probably just got hung up at work. They've been really busy there lately, and he likes to be there watching I everything. I like these noodles. I'm yeah, glad you like the noodles. I'm eating like a, like a supervisor. <laughs> no. Better believe it. Would you pass the bread, please? Bread. Thank you. Please and thank you. That, that's, that's good, young man. <laughs> Mrs. Flowers would like you. That's right. Hello? Hey, the prodigal son. Oh, sorry I'm late. We had a bunch of change orders and then the traffic was crazy. Hey. Hey. How's school? Good. Good? Good. Brian? Brian, this is James Jones. James, this is my son, Brian. How do you do, James? I'm doing okay. Brian wants to shake your hand, James. I, uh, I understand you've been getting along well with my father. You have to give me some pointers. <laughs> uh, how long have you uh, been at the center, James? James has been working at the center for over eight years, Brian. I, I just got to know him recently, and we've become friends. Right, James? James is a hero. He saved Bob's life, you know. <laughs> Don't remind him. <laughs> it's nice to see that, that something good came out of such a bad thing. James, what is it that you do at the center? He doesn't talk anymore. Shh. But he doesn't have to say anything if he doesn't want to, honey, okay? You just eat, okay? Mm. <clears throat> Maybe James doesn't want to be on display. He's not on display, Brian. Mm Those are James's new teeth, and they're, they're, they're probably uncomfortable. Are they uncomfortable, James? James! Wait! Please! Stop! You? You've got a son! Yes, I do. A son with, with a job, a job with a desk. Yes, he does. A job with a desk. You must be... You must be very proud.
<clears throat> we bow to the glory of the Lord. We are humble. We are all humble. We take a breath, and he is there. Amen. We make mistakes, we fall down, and he is still there. Yeah. We are all in his sights. Amen. We are all in his heart. Amen. Some of us are black. Some of us are white. Some of us are Cherokee. But in his eyes, we are one. We are yes. one. No matter what sad things, what bad things try to drag us down to the ground, we can still look up. We can stand up straight, straight and tall, and we will. For the love of God, we will. Amen. Amen. spoke with the voice of a supervisor up there. The voice God gave you to make people listen. I was, I was so proud. I'm, I'm so sorry. I was thinking with my head. I wasn't thinking with my heart when I invited you home to supper. I thought maybe it might make your path clearer if I introduced you to my son. By my father, Dr. Shushan. I don't know whether I can find your father, James. Try. That's what you always say to me. Uh, I will try. I will try with everything I possibly can. Okay? The desk. <laughs> the barber. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. James. Here. What are these? Memos. Supervisors get memos. What are they about? About things. Our repair is a place to mess. Got work to do, Dana. Work to do. <sighs> Regulation FBI. James, can I 